In this training video, we're going to review the operation of the breathing air system located on Tower 201. This system allows our firefighters to operate inside the platform of the truck, breathing air without the need to wear an air pack. Tower 201 is equipped with two 4500 PSI breathing air cylinders located on the turntable next to the control stand. When breathing air is needed in the platform, one firefighter can open up a cylinder on top of one of the cylinders fully. There are two pressure gauges to the right of the cylinders. One gauge indicates the incoming pressure from the cylinder that is open. The other gauge indicates the pressure that's outgoing after the pressure reducer. When the first cylinder is open, there will be a brief intermittent alarm until the pressure is above the low air alarm point. If that low air alarm sound does not stop, the firefighter should close that one cylinder and open the other cylinder. Inside the platform, there are three outlets for up to three firefighters to be supplied with breathing air. One is behind the operator, the other two are on the right side of the bucket. Also in the platform, there's a storage bin on the front door that contains three regulators with approximately 10 feet of air line. Firefighters must remember to bring their SCBA face mask with them into the platform and able to use the breathing air system. The regulators in the platform have the same basic function and operation as the regulators on the air packs that we utilize. However, it does not have the low air vibe alert feature or the heads up display that indicates the remaining air supply. When the firefighters are ready to go on air inside the platform, they could take the section of hose, it's approximately 10 feet long, and they'll tie in to the quick connect fitting on the platform. The firefighter can then insert the regular into their face mask and re resume normal breathing off the air cylinders on the platform. Again, the air line is approximately 10 feet, gives firefighters the ability to operate throughout the platform and also operate from the front platform outside the main bucket if they need to perform a vertical ventilation operation. During operations, the operator at the turntable should periodically check the gauge on the breathing air system to assure that there is adequate air supply remaining in the cylinder. Once the uh, air cylinder reaches a low air point, an audible alarm will sound at the turntable and an amber light will illuminate in both the platform and at the turntable control to alert all firefighters that the air is getting low. A firefighter can then open up the valve on the second cylinder and turn off the first cylinder, thereby keeping air supply into the system. Once operations are completed, the firefighters can turn off both cylinder valves and bleed off the remaining air in the system by opening up a regulator inside the platform. With all operations completed, the truck can be taken to station 21 and the air cylinders completely refilled using the breathing air compressor at that station.